everybody. So that was our workout. That was our workout cardio craze. And uh, since I've been going a little stir crazy being sick over the weekend, I decided to make the chat topic going crazy. So um, luckily for me, I, I was just stuck inside, you know. But for some people, like going crazy is a big deal. I mean, your mind is a powerful thing. And if you think about, like, you know, just a classic example being how your brain can trick yourself, uh, an anorexic person, you know, they're 85 pounds, they're skin and bones, but they still think that they're fat, you know, because something's not right up in there, you know, something's not right down in there. Same thing with, like, people that are hoarders, you know, like, who wants to live in a trash pile? Not me, probably not you, but there are people out there that do. You know, they just don't take care of themselves. Something's not right up there, okay? Um, and then along with this topic today, you know, so aside from just, you know, the internal conflict for you upon yourself going crazy, you know, crazy about your body, crazy about, you know, if you're a neat freak or whatever kind of, like, internal crazy things that you have, uh, you know, there's also going crazy on other people, okay? And that's not good, okay? Okay? <laughs> So while sitting at home this weekend, I had, I had the distinct pleasure to fall upon the Lifetime channel. <laughs> and I watched a bunch of movies on there, a bunch of movies on there, and let me just tell you, I mean, I know it's just TV, I know, you know, it's just television, but, you know, the, the writers got inspiration from someone, okay? They got inspiration from real life, real people, real situations. And so, you know, if you're having a conflict with someone else, do not go crazy about it, okay? Like, I'll just take some examples. I'll take some examples from Lifetime, all right? Do not stalk people, okay? No. Do not obsess about people. No, okay? <laughs> no. Do not kill people, okay? No, do not hurt anybody. If you're not getting your way, don't hurt anybody, right? Do not force yourself on people, you know, either sexually or in the way of constantly badgering them or harassing them with text messages, emails, tweets, phone calls. If they don't want to talk to you, well, they don't want to talk to you, okay? Get over it. You got to get you got to get right in yourself. You got to get right in your brain. You can't worry about other people too much. You're not in control of other people. You're not in control of other people, but you're in control of yourself. And you know, if you're having something with somebody, like they deserve the time and space to think about things themselves. They don't need you being crazy on them. That only makes the situation worse. And if you do get into some of these, like, I'm telling you, this lifetime, whoa, you know, I don't know, I don't know who's out there writing this stuff, but you guys, you guys are scaring me so, okay? People killing other people, people stalking outside of each other's houses and waiting, taking their children from, taking their children from their preschools and, you know, killing other people's wives and, you know, uploading other people's privacy things to the internet for the world to see. I mean, that's, that's crazy stuff. If you're feeling crazy, you, know, you need to do something else. You need to focus on yourself. You need to exercise. You need to talk to somebody. Talk to a friend. Talk to your family. Talk to a psychologist if you really think you need that kind of help. But don't go crazy on anybody. Do not go crazy. Everything will be all right. Everything will be all right. You just need to calm down. You need to think things out. You need to not stop people. You know, like, be cool with yourself. Be cool with yourself. Don't go crazy. Okay? Well, I'm glad to be back. I gotta go. Bye, guys. Stop the insanity.